Hey, welcome back. We're gonna be taking a look at the new collection for August 2023, which is the Physics Collection. So this is one of the first collections that's actually exclusive entirely to Strata. In addition to that, this collection has over 9,000 sounds and 69 total Reaper projects associated with it. So this is a massive collection. So we'll go into the main project window and just take a quick look, get a general sense. And then I'll go into an Unreal demonstration that I put together and show you just how in depth you can actually get with this. So the one thing that I can point out immediately is if you look at each different type of service or object, there's already three variations with the project. So there's a small, medium, and large. So these are all like size based. So small rock, large rock, medium rock, and then so on for each different surface or prop type. Every surface is extremely well covered. Um, so this is probably, I mean, it was designed to essentially be the last physics sound library you really would ever need. So it doesn't really, it doesn't fall short of that, to be honest with you. So let's go ahead and just have a quick listen to a few things here. Here's some of the large concrete or concrete large surface. So those are some sweeteners there. And some of the glass small destructions. Let's hear one of the large ones as well for contrast. So here's some of the metal hollow impacts. How about some uh, some water? So your water medium surface impact hard. All right, here's something nice and delicate. Uh, wood hollow small impact sweeteners. Okay, so overall impression of this collection, there's so much material in here that it's kind of crazy. Uh, I could see it really fitting in well and also supplementing any of the other collections you have, like your, your Foley collections, like the footsteps or any of the other body, even some of the weapons, you could use a lot of this physics material in conjunction to like flesh out the rest of your design work on a project. I really like that not only do you have small, medium and large variations or actual props, but that each small, medium and large prop also has different intensities and they all have so many variations. I think some of them have up to like 14 variations. It's so flexible. You can pretty much do anything that you need to do with any given material type. It's just all the way covered. It's probably, it's probably a strong case to get Strata just so you can get access to this physics collection. It's that large and that convenient of a collection. Um, this is going to replace a large portion of my library that I would normally go into. This is this makes things so much easier for this type of material. So it's probably one of the best collections to date, in my opinion. All right, we're going to go into the ice medium surface project here. Uh, so this is kind of a good, good one to look at because I used it in my demonstration just to get a sense of the light medium versus hard. There's light, medium, hard. So you'll see that functionality again for each of the different performances or each of the different types of impacts or uh, physics actions. In terms of layers, um, there's two kind of different components in here. There's loops. So for the things like the scrapes or the bends, there's going to be loops start and stop also associated with those. Um, and then for your impacts, you have a basic layer, a debris layer, a sub layer, and then a custom layer for, for the loops occasionally is also in there. So the destruction has a lot of layers on here that we can kind of dig in and listen to. So base layer, debris low, debris high. So there's a little crack detail. And here's the sub, the punch. And you put them all together, you have this. All right, so maybe mute a couple of these. There's with the details out. No sub, sub. All right, looking at one of the loops, this is the scrape fast. So again, there's fast, medium, and slow. We have a grit layer with this. So that's for the looping component. There's also a base layer. 
and you put them together. And also we have the start and stop over here as well. And then the stop should be over here. So again, you're well covered in terms of you need to make some ice slide around, you're good to go here. Going into the implementation and design demo, I was able to do something pretty elaborate, maybe not always practical. What I came up with should give you a really idea of you know how in depth you can actually go and how well covered the material is and how much you can actually accomplish with it. Let's just listen to the object uh, in question here. It's just a big pane of ice. So let's see what happens when I shoot at it. All right, so you can hear an initial destruction and then pieces depending on how small or large they are, different sounds. That one over there for fun, why not? Definitely don't wanna spend all day inside of the blueprint here, but the one thing that I wanted to point out, I'm gonna be using the mass and the velocity from the chaos physics collisions to basically drive whether it's gonna be a small, medium, or hard impact, and then also what the size of the, of the prop should be, whether it's a small, medium, or large actual chunk of ice. So my events, I have a break, medium debris, and small debris. So real quick, let's just listen to each of these events so you can see how they sort of match up with what's in the editor. Break. Small debris. Medium debris. I also have just a sweetener, which is more of the, uh, not quite full on destruction, but more crumbling, more kind of, grittiness to it. All right, so once again, thank you for watching. Um, hopefully that gives you a good idea of what you can do with the collection and those demonstrations were helpful. If you do have any questions about the collection or about Strata, you can always feel free to, to reach out. Another reminder, this uh, physics collection, it is like totally exclusive to Strata. So this is uh, stuff that you're not gonna get anywhere else. And it was designed from the ground up with you know this type of workflow in mind so i think it's you know it's a, it's a great collection uh until next month uh we'll see you then and thank you take care